billions of EU assistance going to Ukraine are not free, they're loans, which Ukraine will default on, and they come with neoliberal strings attached. If you listen to The Economist, Ukraine is marked for a nightmare round of shock therapy, a sell-off of public land, deregulation of labour, sale of public assets, on it goes. The country's future is being sold to finance a proxy war that's tearing it apart. And of course the loans have preconditions that Ukraine must uphold democracy and rule of law, but since the tap was turned on, Zelensky has banned most opposition parties, shuttered the media, attack trade unions and workers' rights, but the billions keep flowing. This is a country, our Court of Auditors have said, was a country accused of grand corruption. And on it goes while the EU policy seems designed to prevent peace and keep the war going at all costs as long as ordinary people pay. So between Russian tanks and European banks, there will be little left of Ukraine when this is over. Don't forget, war is a racket and there's going to be hell to pay for this one.